Well, I had called for Representative Shooter to resign months ago when this first came out. I think um, that would have been the, the right thing to do for the people he represents and, and the right thing to do for the legislature. The results released today came after several months of investigation into allegations against Representative Shooter. The interviews with those alleging the misbehavior and those who witnessed it was done by an outside law firm, Sherman and Howard. Lawyers say Shooter had requested this investigation and participated the whole time. They're confident their findings and the speaker's decision are accurate and fair. The one thing about this investigation that I found particularly um, enlightening was how quick people were, at least publicly, to just jump to the conclusion that something had happened. Uh, you know, I call it the scarlet hashtag, you know, now in, in 2018.